friends today i'm going to teach about compact topological space so let's begin first we will understand what is the meaning of open covering let x t be a topological space then a family or we can call it as set of open subsets of x t given as g i i from the index set i this is a family where each g i's are the open subsets of x t then this family is called an open covering of the topological space x t if this set whole set x becomes equal to union of e g i's then if this property holds for the set x then this family g i's where e g i's are the open covering open set sorry then this family is called an open covering of this topological space x t we can also define it as if we take a subset of the set x let a be any subset here then this family g i where i belongs to the index set i where index set is like natural numbers then this set your this family of open subsets where e g i's are open subsets is called open covering of this subset a if a is a subset of union of e g i if this property hold then this family of open subsets is called an open covering of this subset a now we take an example here to understand clearly let x be any set where it has three elements a b and c we consider a topology where the elements are phi x the subset a subset b subset c subset a b subset b c and subset a c as this is the largest topology from this set x so this topology will be called as discrete topology discrete topology this is the largest topology in any set and the number of open sets these are called open subsets elements of any topology are called the open subset of this topology so the number of top open subsets in discrete topology will be equal to 2 to the power n 2 to the power n where n is the number of elements from the set here it is 3 so it will be equal to 2 to the power 3 is equal to 8 so here should be 8 elements 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 now if you take from this definition then let this family of open subset is equal to the subset a subset b and subset c then clearly this set x where x is equal to a a b c will be equal to union of these open open subsets a 
P C. So if you take union of these subsets, then it is equal to the set A B C. So this is this is called an open covering of this set X. Now consider from this definition where we take a subset of this set X. Let A be equal to the set AB where this set is clearly a subset of this X. Then again we take this example of open covering where GI I from the index set I is equal to the set where the elements are subsets A, B and subset C. Then clearly this set or subset A of X where it is equal to the set AB becomes a subset of union of this open covering where we take A, B, C. So this is equal to A, B, C. So clearly this subset is a subset of union of the element of open covering. So clearly this family is becomes becomes an open covering of this subset. So I hope you understood the meaning of open covering. Now we will understand the meaning of open subcovering. Open subcovering. Let X be any topological space and GI I belongs to capital I where E GIs are open subsets, it represents an open covering of XT. Then an open covering GI where I belongs to say capital J where capital J is a subset of this capital I will be called as open subcovering open subcovering of XT if X becomes equal to I small i belongs to capital J this capital J GI if this property hold for this open covering or this family then this family will be called as open sub covering as we take the subset of this capital I which is G J so this open sub this family is called an open sub covering now we will understand the meaning of compact topological space it is related related to the this definition open subcovering compact topological space let x t be a topological space then this is called a compact topological space if by definition it is it is stated that if every open covering of x t can be reduced into finite open subcovering this topological space is called a compact topological space if every open sub open covering of xt can be reduced into finite open subcovering now we take a, an example here the same example x is equal to a b c so we took the 
open covering as a b and c this we took the for the open covering then clearly x is equal to union of this open covering a so this becomes equal to this set but from the definition we can see that the finite open subcovering it should be it should have a finite open subcovering but from this line we can see that it is it is a finite open subcovering because the number of subsets is 3 so it is finite we can consider also that if we take the open covering as the set a b c and c we take another subset ab then this is clearly a open covering of this set x because if we take union of all these subsets union of gi then it becomes a b and c so and this is equal to this whole set x which is abc so this is also a open covering of x but from this line we can see that this is a sub covering of this open covering because the number of elements here is 3 and here is 4 so this is a subset but it is also a finite because the number of element is 3 so this is a finite open sub covering of this open covering so this set this topological space is called a compact topological space we can note here that if we take any subset which is a finite then it is a compact topological space so we can note here that every finite topological space is a compact topological space so i hope you understood the meaning of compact topological space if you any doubt then please comment in the comment box i will answer so that's it for today thank you